Hey everybody, I'm Johannes Moser. I play the cello and um, I'm very happy to be on Practicing Tips and hopefully some of this is going to be helpful. Okay, so our first question for you, Mr. Moser, is do you have a specific warm-up routine? I do. First of all, I try to warm up before I go to the instrument. So I'll do maybe 30 minutes of yoga or I'll try to just do some basic exercises to get my pulse going uh, because I don't think one should warm up the body at the instrument, but actually before, because yeah. most of the um, uh, problems that we get physically, like, you know, some people get tendonitis or some people mm -hmm. get tense in the shoulders or something like that. That is because they don't really warm up before they go to the instrument. So I find that very important. Then um, I start with open strings, just very basic, just to see how the instrument is talking and mm. to see how high are the strings today because my strings tend to change quite a bit especially with a you know when when oh, i yeah. do travel mm -hmm. then i just want to see well where where are we at today so then i go to i basically have this book called for yar for yar daily exercises and uh, there are some trill exercises in the beginning and then i do um you know just uh, scales with my double stops, I, I did do a video on that. So I'll do uh, thirds, fourths, uh, fifths, tritones, mm -hmm. uh, sevenths, and um, did I mention sixths? I think so. And, um, and tenths. I mm -hmm. think tenths are really important to have every day. Yes. Um, and just, you know, sort of get, get me generally ready. And I do change the... Um, the keys according to the pieces that I practice. Mm -hmm. So if I, yeah. you know, high D major is an obvious one, but uh, it's not so obvious when you practice the Schoenberg Concerto because there is a new harmony every bar. So <laughs> I <laughs> yeah. try to pick, pick, you know, something weird like like F sharp minor or something like that. Yeah, I actually I watched the interview. I mean, the interview, the video on double stops. Um, you know, whenever it was posted. And I remember talking to a friend about it and he was like, I can't believe Johannes does sevens every single day. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I love it because the, the thing is what we want to train with thirds and with sevens is, mm -hmm. is the um, frame of the hand. So uh, the outer frame, obviously, you know, being first and fourth finger. So yeah. the problem is when we practice thirds is that we have a different intonation system than when we play individual fingers, right? Because we are uh, practicing this in the just intonation and with Pythagorean intonation, when you play individual fingers, mm -hmm. you're going to have different notes. With sevenths, you don't have that problem because sevenths are the same in, in, both, in both systems. Oh. Uh, so that's I why I that. find them a little bit, uh, well, I find them just as helpful as thirds. Yes. But I think, I think one, should, one should do both. And also with sixths, I think it's great to also have have um, tritones so just to turn it around yeah so to have both available that will take me about you know between 20 and 40 minutes depending on on how how much into detail i want to go yes but i try to do just you know so, some sort of housekeeping every morning um and, and and get myself settled and then i feel like okay when i go into a piece i'm warm the physically but also my ear is tuned and i find that really important yes yeah that's a really good point to tune your ear to what you want to be hearing when you're practicing, you know? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's yeah. Great. And, and, you know, I'm, I'm not always listening just to, to obviously to, to classical, like, like a, like pop song, then obviously, first of all, the sound is super compressed, but also the intonation is so ultra clean that you need to come back to, okay, there are different intonation systems, put and pure and tempered and all that. And uh, where do I want to position myself today with my playing, you know, mm -hmm. with, with Ariana Grande's uh, auto-tune uh, intonation. Yeah. <laughs> no offense, Ariana.